welcome to another episode of Carbs. You know, the show we're sitting in a car and BS while consuming carbs. Matt Zion here. We are back for day two of our big new rhesus girthy, lengthy, kind of veiny, penisy. It's not penises though. Uh, special. So if you missed yesterday's episode, I'll link it down below. We did the potato chip big cup rhesus peanut butter cup. Delicious, by the way. Mm -mm -mm. Well, they hit us with a double whammy because now we get to try the peanut brittle Reese's Big Cup, which I'm super excited about. I just found out about this one like last week too. Unlike the chips, that was like a two year odyssey of waiting. This one, they just announced and they're releasing for the holiday season, as well as this one here, uh, Hershey's Sugar Cookie Bar. Now, I'm not a big fan of Hershey's overall. I think that there's really one situation and one situation only where a Hershey's chocolate bar comes into play. S'mores when you're camping. That's it. No, like, that's it. I, I, just, I would never just grab one of these and be like, yo, I'm going to eat a Hershey's chocolate bar. It just it wouldn't work that way. If I'm going to get something chocolatey, I'll go with a Snickers. I'll go with a Reese's Peanut Butter Cup, Reese's Pieces. Like, there's just, there's so many other variants of chocolate out there that I would rather gain weight and slowly end my life through delicious sugary means uh, than ever read, like, Hershey's. I just, Hershey's to me is just, eh, whatever. Sugar cookies, by the way, we're going to start with this one first. Sugar cookies, um, they, they're okay. The, the, the problem is, my mom makes amazing sugar cookies. Like, it's kind of, she's known for it. She sells them. Like, people have been ordering them for, for years. I've, you know, I've had them on my friends try them. It's, it's not a biased thing in that saying that they're the best sugar cookies of all time. It is on my end, but like I said, I've had a lot of other people. And I've tried them and she runs a business that where she sells them. So I know that they're really good. So every time I've tried a sugar cookie product since, you know, being born out of her vagina, right, my dad shot that load in there and then I came flying out. It happened within like three seconds. It was so weird. He's like, oh, and I'm like, ah, that's how, that's how I was made. Uh, I just, sugar cookies to me just are never that good unless they're the ones that she makes. So let's try it out though, and let's see. Want to? Uh, I was almost not gonna do this, but I'm like, yeah, why not? You know, I was in, I was in Walgreens where you can get both these items, and I was like, let's, uh, let's give it a go. Why not? All right, there we go. Let's try it. The fact that it's like white chocolate sucks. Um, not a fan of that. I do like the texture of it though. It's a little grainy, uh, and it melts in your mouth. That's good. It does taste like a sugar cookie too. I mean, if you love sugar cookies, if this is your go-to cookie, I think you'd really like this. I think this would hit the spot. For me, I mean, it's good, but it's a waste of time. I'd, again, I'd rather put the calories into something like the next product we're gonna do. Oh, but I would rate this. It's all right, I'll give it a three out of five. It's better than regular Hershey's. So, I mean, that's a win. Also, back us on Patreon if you wanna see the content that was too hot for YouTube, aka the drinking games and the vomit stuff, the vomit challenges, and the main shows, because YouTube was dumb and forced us to remove it, and that's the only way we could really get it available to you. So, Patreon, $2 a month. Also, twitch.tv slash reckless eating. Give us a follow over there. For gaming goodness, I'm on there almost every day playing video games. Come say hi. All right, peanut brittle. Peanut brittle's delicious. Uh, I love peanut brittle, but I don't go out of my way to eat it. It's like one of those things, cause like I really consider it generational. Uh, old people love peanut brittle, but I like it too. I just, again, it's it's not, if, if I have to choose between certain items, oh God, I think a plane's gonna land on me. Okay, no, it passed. Uh, I'm gonna skip peanut brittle. Like I'll grab some other things instead, like peanut butter and chocolate combo is always better, but hey, oh, it's white chocolate too. Damn it, I didn't even notice that. Peanut brittle flavored cream with crunchy peanut butter. Oh, wait a minute. No, it's, pe it's peanut brittle. The actual cream is also peanut brittle. It's not white chocolate. Okay. I did not see that coming whatsoever. That's going to help improve a lot. I'm sorry. White chocolate is so bland. All white chocolate tastes exactly the same. Like at least regular chocolate has its variations. Mm. But I just feel like white chocolate is so lame. I know Chris completely disagrees with me. Uh, Chris, Chris Reckless is all about white chocolate. That's his favorite. So, all right, here we go. Let's do it. It's good, but it's nowhere near as good as the potato chip one. Now, the issue I have with this one is that it really doesn't taste like a Reese's peanut butter cup. It tastes almost like uh, a candy you would get uh, from like uh, like a boutique or something. I had to think about that word for a second. Like an old people place, you know? Like, it's like grandma's like, mm, you wanna try the candy from when I was young? And like, it's good, but grandma, you didn't, you didn't know shit about candy, all right? Sorry. You just didn't. 
I mean, I would I would argue this is worse than a regular Reese's peanut butter cup also. It just has nothing in common with it. You barely taste the actual peanut butter on the inside. It's almost entirely dominated by that peanut brittle flavor. Oh God, I mean, this is this is not, it's, again, I'll, I'll give it a four out of five. But if you know me, and you most of you do that have watched this channel or are still watching this channel at this point, if, to give a Reese's product anything less than a solid five out of five is kind of like giving it an FU. I don't know. I would. I would never eat this ever again. That's this. This is the last bite. Peanut brittle. Rest in peace. Mm, yeah. Too dominant on the um, the actual peanut brittle. So I guess maybe if you're crazy about that, you know, type of uh, candy, this will be for you. But uh, I think it misses the mark for me personally. But what are your thoughts on these? Let me know in the comments down below. I'm gonna sit here and eat the last of my potato chip big cup uh, and completely destroy any progress I made with my health today. Enjoy this Twitch clip. We'll see you on the next one. Um. Oh, it, <gasps> it Charlie bit me.